understand how to be influential in the lives of other people. Now let me just sort of give you a sort of some back theory on it so that we can then progress and, and talk about the pragmatic parts of it. Influence is simply the ability to change another person's thoughts, beliefs, and actions. Okay, you might be able to come up with a different idea, a uh, different uh, definition, but my definition is simply this. The ability to change other people's thoughts, beliefs, and actions. Now, let's think about that for a moment. If you could change other people's thoughts, beliefs, and actions, just think how your life would change. If when you spoke, or you wrote, or you emailed, or you engaged with other people, you could change their thoughts, their beliefs, and their actions. How many of you would love to be able to change your spouse's thoughts, beliefs, and actions? Right? Any of you have teenagers? I have four teenagers. My boy just went to college, he's 19, and then I have a 17-year-old girl, a 15-year-old girl, and a 14-year-old girl. How many of you that have teenagers and children would love to be able to change your teenagers' thoughts, beliefs, or actions? How would it help your business if when you're sitting across the table at a coffee shop with somebody, telling them about the, the business opportunity, or you're maybe in front of a small little group at a, at a hotel and giving a, a business presentation, how many of you would like to be able to change other people's thoughts, beliefs, and actions? So that when you engage, they say, you know what, I'm going to change my thinking, that's right. I do want to get out of the corporate world where I, uh, I want to get out of the rat race of the corporate world and get into the right race of owning my own destiny. How many of you would like to be able to do that? Now, influence is an interesting thing. Influence is something that begins at the very beginning of life and it actually goes all the way through to the end of life. Influence 